Welcome to Two Minutes Tutorials. In this video, we're gonna talk about how to draw chains. To start with, I'm just gonna go ahead and draw a path for my chain. I'm gonna start pretty small and then just slowly get bigger as I get closer to the foreground. And that's just gonna give me a nice path to work with. So I'm gonna go ahead and lighten that down. So from here, I'm just gonna draw some basic chain links along this path. And so what I've got for chain links, I've got one link going this way, the other link going this way. And that's basically it. I can also, slightly angle my chain and I can just draw this part like this and this part like this. I'm seeing both sides of the chain and it gives it a little more three dimensionality and we'll do that as we go along here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and very, very simply just block in one edge of my chain just to get my sizing. And I wanna go smaller as I go back. So I wanna be aware of that. And so I'm gonna go ahead and, and kind of Fill in the detail of my chain just a little bit more, just so I've got my rough in just a little bit more complete here. As you can see, I'm not perfectly exactly lined up with everything. That's really not the point. It's all just a guideline. And as I round this corner, I'm gonna to wanna to take this part here and angle it in that direction. And I feel like this link is getting just a little bit wide, so I really want to thin that out just a little bit. Now with the next piece, I'm gonna keep going in that direction. And with the next one, I'm gonna angle it again just like this. And then I'm gonna angle it again and I'm kind of coming off my line here a little bit, but it's really just a guideline. And we're gonna keep going along my general path. Now, as I go up here, I wanna to start to angle my chain a little bit. And so let's start to do that. I'm gonna give this just a little bit of dimension here, just by doing this. I'm gonna to start to angle this one just out like this a little bit. And now I'm kind of reversing. So this one is gonna start to have a little bit more shape than this one. And I've got my path to give me a general size. So I don't need to be perfect. None of this is mathematical at all. And so that's my basic layout. And really that's 90% of the work done. I'm just gonna go ahead and lay that down. I'm gonna use what I have here to start tightening this up. and our chain right here, just with a link. And there we go, that's a chain, uh, very, very quickly and easily. I'm gonna go ahead and take this just one step further quickly and add some shadow to it. And this is gonna cast a shadow down over this. And I'm just gonna go ahead and, and cast shadows from my link. And that's basically it. And there you go. Uh, very, very easy to do. Chains are just simple geometric shapes in space. Uh, if you can understand how to draw uh, a cube or a rectangle uh, and then just hollow it out, you can draw a chain in, in three dimensions. So there you go. But you don't want to start with this because it will make your life very difficult. What you want to do is just start with a very, very simple path and then just think in terms of simple lengths and then finish out your chain on top of that. And do it in a stage process, it makes everything so much easier for you to get your head around and not get overwhelmed with something that really is very, very simple. All right, thank you very much. I will see you in the next video.